Hey, what's going on guys? John here, and today I'm actually going to be doing a video review for the Juvie High Chair. Um, in this video, I'll just kind of walk you through um, some of the usage of this, um, talk a little bit about our experience now that um, our child is actually about to turn three years old, and um, overall give you my thoughts on it. So um, this has been an amazing, amazing high chair. Um, you have a very large surface area here, whether or not it's for uh, both eating and for crafts, things like that. It comes with a plastic piece, which I don't have here at the moment, that you can actually overlay and it snaps onto the corners here on the ends. So let's say your child is having a meal, um, they make a mess on the tray, you can simply just take that tray off and you don't have to take this whole big tray um, over to the sink. It's just the, the actual plastic that goes over it. So it's very clever that they came up with that. You do have a standard buckle here. So um, this basically comes down and then you have the side pieces which buckle into um, a center piece. So it's pretty straightforward to actually do that. There's a piece that comes up through the middle. So you have the Juvie branding right there. So it's very easy to buckle them. Our child has kind of gotten to a point where um, typically if they're seated and their knees are under this, they're usually not gonna be able to climb up out of it. So you could even put them in the chair without necessarily buckling them um, once they get a little bit older. Um, it's very easy to you know remove this and it's something that if you leave it in a space like where you know your child is normally playing and you're not you know you don't want to worry too much about it if this obviously was not here they may climb up into the chair and start playing and using it as a way to get up on like tables and things like that um, this is actually very difficult to remove you have to um, at least for a child that is you have to come under here and there, there's actually a push mechanism so you have to pull this and then that releases a hinge which then allows you to remove this from its base um, now once you go to reinsert it you have to do the same thing so it's very easy for adults but not easy for children so it makes it for something if you didn't have this here they can easily climb on the step stool portion there and then come all the way up um, it does have wheels so you can easily roll this back and forth um, I have seen a few different variations of this Juvie high chair so um, depending on the one that you have it may or may not have wheels um, the actual backing on this has been fairly sturdy we have cats and and some of them have gotten to it a little bit, but overall it's you know maintained its condition. Um, over time you will get food and stuff that falls down beneath. You can even see there's a little bit down there that's just kind of you know older food that's been spilled and stuff, pretty typical with kids. And um, what we usually do is we'll take it outside and we'll either um, hose it off, let it dry in the actual sun, or we'll just take like a ton of wipes to it, bring it out and wipe all the food out because uh, otherwise you're gonna get it all over the floor and you'll be vacuuming a lot. So it's pretty easy to move it through doors. Um, our daughter has actually recently been realizing she can roll it around and she'll like move it up to the couch and then climb up on top of it and try to like use it as something to do that with. Um, the nice thing about this is because it has those wheels, we're able to like move it into somewhere like where it is now, which is in her bedroom and we'll just lock the door so she can't come in here and climb all over it. So that didn't really start happening until recently and she's about to turn three. So I wouldn't worry too, too much about that. Um, but overall, I've been extremely happy with the Juvie high chair. Um, I don't regret, you know, getting this by any means, despite her, you know, deciding to climb on it at this point. But I think that's just coming with age and regardless of whatever high chair you have, children are all, always going to make an attempt to um, get into things, so to speak. So yeah, I'm very, very happy with it. Hopefully you guys found the video review helpful and I will talk to you later.